Mr. Poole, there you are. I'm so happy to see you. Happy to see you, too, my little coupon picker-upper. <laughs> Come on, now, walk me to class. Hey, look what I just got. It's a digital personal assistant. Watch this. I just sent myself a fax. Mr. Oh. Poole, I know you're really happy with your money, but you know, easy come, easy go. Oh, did I tell you? I'm funding a grant. It's called the Eugene Poole Award for Burnt Out Teachers. <laughs> the healing begins now. That's a beautiful dream. Oh, man, I just wish everybody could be as happy as I am. Mr. Poole? Mm -hmm. Just enjoy the next 40 minutes. Of course, it's time for science. <laughs> Aerobic respiration is correct. Well done, Timmy. Here you go. And remember, everyone, you should learn for the sake of learning and not just for gold. Well, that's my last lump for now. I'll just make some more up tonight. <laughs> Paul, you got it wired up here. <laughs> no. No. It's gone. I lost it. I never wrote it down. Oh, this is a terrible thing. Oh. <laughs> Sabrina, you look bummed. Yeah, like everyone else. I'm not bummed. I made my peace with Universal Wheat Love. Really? Yeah. Watch. <laughs> Can I have your attention? I just wanted to say that I ran for president because I thought the job was about more than dances and lunch food. I was wrong. So I think you'll be better off with Libby. I'm in control. Yes, <laughs> and I am one step closer to the White House. <laughs> nice speech. So you're happy? Very. I'd much rather be jaded than naive. Who wouldn't? <laughs> hey, Sabrina, you know how you were feeling sorry for me yesterday? You mean in that blameless third party sort of way? Well, you should know that since I've been injured, I've been having a lot of fun. I'm reading more, I'm writing more. I even think my grades are going to improve. Wow, so the sitting around thing is really working for you. Yeah, I'm super happy not playing football. Just don't tell my dad. A equals A. Of course A equals A. It's obvious. It doesn't need to be stated. Mr. Poole? What? Oh, it's you. Do you have a minute? Yes, a lifetime of them. And now they're going by very slowly. You know, I was just thinking that Jenny's happier not being class president, and Harvey's happier not starting on the football team, and, well, it made me think that maybe you'll be happier not being rich. Hmm. Happier not being rich? Are you nuts? Being rich is everything I ever dreamed of, and now it's gone. It's all gone. Not again. Sabrina, could you help me? Sorry, Mr. Poole. I'm not supposed to help anyone. But I guess one last time won't hurt. No, oh, why couldn't somebody just destroy me? It can't be that bad. And I have a feeling things will get better real soon. And who knows? Maybe you'll find a new briefcase. Yeah, right.